Yo everybody and welcome back to RDD2. Now Keegan, why are you I guess you're wondering why am I chilling here by the church and why am I not by my camp? Because I made a booboo last night guys, so I recorded a full clip and my recording was off something was not the audio of the sound of the game was not being picked up from my whole recording. So yeah, this is the summary quickly. So yeah, so this is, I have to jailbreak Micah out of jail. And what happens is, he talks, I go to the jail, I go to the office, and this says, hey, I'm looking for Micah. Do anybody have leads on who he's about? I know he's in jail, but I act as a bounty hunter. They say, oh, we don't trust you, and we already have a captive, and he's in the jail down below, down the stairs here. But I go outside, and I see the window, and I speak to him, and... I don't trust him and I give him a little shouting at because he's not so trustworthy and we still talk 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 and we get him out of jail he's like okay use the steam donkey okay we, I get the steam donkey and I walk I grab the hook which is conveniently there and I put it by the window and pull the lever which eventually breaks the thing um, I hand him a gun and he shoots a Driscoll in the head and we have a fight and now we have a big bounty on our list and we shot pew pew fighting I see we have to fight this whole town I don't understand pew pew and we just destroy the whole town now I didn't know that shooting so many times will lead to my downfall which I'll explain now after this and pew and we finish it right off but we're still getting chased so we have to still shoot and Mike kills that guy over there and I kill this guy in the head beautiful hat off flying and I'm still running away getting caught horse chased I put my thing away my gun away and now we are free not really free because I got a big bounty so now he says uh, I ask him are you going to camp he says no I've still got a lot of debt to do and he says but we can still work together but anyway he says bye I said bye and because of Micah now I'm with a $300 bounty thank you Micah yeah, so as you can see as you see by that video I have this damn bounty on my head now I have a $300 bounty where is this place in strawberry 300 bounty now I need to try and make this money because I am apparently wanted dead or alive so I can't get arrested and paid off so so I'm wanted dead or alive in that area so I don't know what to do um, I'm a bit nervous I think I just I first want to go pay this bill I have to pay this bounty and then apparently I wanted to do it alive. So I don't know how we're going to do that. But that seems like a mission. But let's make some money. Now, as you can see, we got Tennessee Walker being always as good as he's normally supposed to be. My baby this. Um, we can now, apparently, because we built our relationship, we're on level 4 now with the relationship, I can do this with it. Just swerve to the left and the right. Nothing amazing. Okay. And of course you saw me doing this and I can you know, I can do handbrake turns with my horse. Which is awesome. Now I know there's many ways of making money. Hunting is one way. And then I also heard that stealing coaches. Okay make you money but I don't know where to take the coach so I'm not gonna do that so I think we'll, yeah. we'll have to go either make some money in gambling too I know we can make money by playing poker um, and selling off meat I have to make three hundred dollars three hundred dollars exceed what is this I need to make money I need to make money how to make money making money making money let's go straight to that mission man and then maybe i can find money on the way i'll hunt some animals 
and I'm on the dinner life so let's see what happens I'm curious um, and my food I'm okay in health I'm okay in health I'm okay with data my data is okay I'll just eat biscuits just in case and let's go then this walker seems fine he actually needs some f he looks like he's a bit tired to be honest so I'll go a bit slow and then I'll feed him later now as I'm playing this game you, you're kind of getting what the theme is it's like like where the game of being a cowboy in this world the, the world is about to change basically like they're not accepting this cowboy lifestyle and people are becoming more civilization so him being the one of the last few people like that, that you know I think it's hard for him to change his ways because he also tries to be a good guy but in his heart I just have to be good here because I'm about this quite big here So hopefully I won't die. That's crazy. This game makes me so nervous with this party. I'll just be doing my thing, riding my horse, riding my horse. But like I was saying, yeah, like, you know, like, you can see he's going through a lot of change in the by his tone, um, he voices, and when he speaks to, when he speaks to people, you can hear he's, he's conflicting in that way. So it's quite, it's quite sad. Uh, but yeah. The world changes, you need to learn to adapt, my friend Arthur. But we keep on going, yeah. Ah, we have, we have, we Help me! My horse died and I'm stuck. The trash. I didn't mean to bump him. I was still bumping people because I'm really causing a lot of conflicts. But I really don't mean <laughs> I honestly don't mean to do it. Um, my horse has a man on his own, you know? I can't afford my bounty. I can't afford my bounty. That just made my heart stop. So the woman sees me, I'm dead. Okay. I need to play as casual. I don't casual, casual, casual. Why is it so much loom in here? Horse, are you safe? Die. 
I'm so glad you're with me. I'm sorry for putting you through so much stress, my friend, Mount Tennessee. Yeah. But when I tell you to... S oh! <laughs> And I know horses can die really, so I'm gonna be very sad when my horse dies. But... Come on. This is the meeting no, spot. How much I know? Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn. Hey guys. I don't know who are chilling like this. Who knows? Hey. Just... Mm. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish best? I'm not quite sure. <laughs> Lonnie's off trying to find out. Anyone been in the black water, see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah. pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Oh, he's that's got a cool. lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's going to remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. We well, want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. I'm not cutting anyone loose. Mm -hmm. Of course not. Ike Skelding's boys are moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Mm. Up here, Zai, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. I sure. Want... Well, we'll rescue Sean and we'll get ourselves lost, good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. See if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Oh, wait. Isn't the way of me quick accessing Malcolm? Yes. Well, the water was the side. So. West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as we feared in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCord. Ah, down there. Reckon those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Mm -hmm. Act natural. We'll be fine. So... You've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Hmm. Especially with you. Come on, let's keep them in sight. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. The longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Push up, come on. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed.
Look, they're pulling into shore. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with. Yeah. Okay, we gotta look. What was I look at? Oh. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, and wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Sure, Charles. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. If we can, leave it to me, gentlemen. I'll go around and create a distraction. Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Crouch down out of sight. Take out your knife. Got my knife out. Let's get in the river. Wait until he's got them off guard before crossing. Gentlemen, excuse me, dear brothers, my wife is taken ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. She's she taken ill. Where is she? A terrible turn. I, I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, Mister. I, I can't. I can't. I, I'm having a fit. <laughs> Come on, let's get up there. A pleasure as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. I will do it because I need the money. the canyon to deal with. Does he have his gun up? I have my gun up. Okay, you mean those boots you got there, eh? Mm. Those are very nice. Who's the guy you got them from? Mm. Is he alive still? Mm. Come on, focus. Oh. I'm a stealthy focus, man. Okay. Red Dead. Get the big daddy out. What's that one? Now let's get the sniper. Ah! Oof. My guns actually because it's messing up. No! 
Zijn kei aan het team. Hij niet half. Oh joh, hier weer eet. Sorry guys. No. Where's my gun? Where's my gun? Here's Charles. All good? Wouldn't go that far. The cat is up this way. Come on. I've got my gun in my hand. Charles, you take the right. I'll go left. Okay. What was I do? Did you say anything about me? I see, I see, I see, I see. No, I don't see. Bro! Give me an angle! You know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do we get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper I can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Have I got stories for you? Yeah. I can't wait. I imagine y'all missed me a lot. But fear not, the joy is back in your lives now. Nice. Just going to loot everything we we'll see.
Okay, so yeah. I'm just looting everybody quickly. It's close by. Mas match boy. Okay, learn to run away from fight. Pro tip: run away from the fight. Don't say too long. Such a good cowboy! <laughs> oh my god! Oh. There was a close call. Uh, I'm not trying to get out of here. <laughs> that was a close call. Um, I need to go now. Okay, I'm still what? Hey, the part is gone. Oh no, it's like I lie, I lie, I lie, I lie. Um, I need to go. I want to go to the question mark, but it's too much of a risk right now. So let's go. What is this? Yeah, I will count it here and go to the that spot. Yeah, let's go there. Okay, let me just make sure my horse is okay. Feed you some food. Poor horse has gone through the most of me. And let me brush him quickly. There's the hooker. No, he doesn't need food. He needs to um, brush. I just need some TLC. Okay, you're looking good now, my friend. I need to eat some tobacco. Tobacco, tobacco. What do I have for tobacco? I need to get a pack of cigarettes. That's what I should buy. Because I'm not going to worry about the party because I'm not needed in that area. So it's not such a big thing. But it's not nice having a bounty on your head, you know? Howdy. Hey, partner. Okay, and let's go off. Howdy, howdy, howdy. I'm slowly getting really invested into this game. It's crazy. I wasn't the one for what, 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 what. One kill me. I'm finishing to get out of here.
Howdy howdy. This way, girl. You ain't joining in? Uh, I think I'll leave the celebration for you. Okay. Hey, listen. I just wanted to say, I know you bastards missed me. <laughs> Even you, Arthur. Can we eat Even some food? Arthur. Oh, Arthur. Now you seem in a good mood. I am, son. I am. Let's have some fun tonight. Let's enjoy ourselves. Are we having a party? Maybe. Just a little one. Great. Okay, we party. So come on, let's have ourselves. Don't do what he missed up here, then you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but the the finest game in the world. Let me just get my lining in, and then we can party, my bro. Then we can party. That food looks good, I must say. Potatoes. Where's the body at? Where's the body at? So you're drinking, pals, back? With a vengeance, it seems. Yeah, I've forgotten how loud. Can I get me a beer? Where's the beer? If I may say so. Oh, there we go. That's crazy. Oh, safe. Let's drink. Chest to shot. Chest to shot. I'll make another one. I'll make another I'm thinking by myself. I'm an alcoholic, bro. Where's the music? Okay. Two just to put me in the right now, I'm going to socialize. <laughs> I put my arm around her waist. Well, what would I do, say? She said, "You made your face more than you did all day." I put my hand upon her side. Well, what I do, say? She said, "You did it pretty good." I did it all day. I put my hand upon her. Mark, well, what I do, say? She said, "Let's lay down on the grass and did it." It's a cool song. Okay, one more guys, one more. But how about something a little more similar? Sure, how many beers can Arthur drink, bro? Oh, there's an alcoholic any like this. Mark my words, all of you, mark my words. There we go, there the man is now lit. And this man is eating chops. <laughs> I am ready to let loose tonight. I'm, I'm thinking on the purpose here. I'll just see how much I can. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you better go easy, Marston. Family man now. Right. I don't think so. Tonight's all about having fun. McGuire's back. And don't we know it? <laughs> <laughs> How many beers can this man take, bro? Hmm. 
yeah so on that note guys i am going to leave it right here um there was nothing more that was going to happen in the game they're just going to basically sing songs and drink more and more and he doesn't get more drunk i tried to get him really drunk but it doesn't really i think that this is a cap or maybe i'm not doing it right maybe i didn't need to find some hard liquor but <laughs> i don't know so yeah so if you enjoyed the episode if you enjoyed this episode please leave a like subscribe always comment down below um i really appreciate it i'm really having fun with this game and yeah i would love to record more of it um so anyway peace and i'll see you next week guys bye bye